Dear members, welcome back to Gesture International. Now we are restarting our same session with the topic YouTube. So this effective application is influencing millions of people in the world. So there are innumerous YouTubers in the world, even kids, even one or two years, two, three years old children are starting YouTube channel. They are, you know, they are curious to speak something and bringing new inventors and ideas to the public. So now let me invite Mithila Motin for having a short talk about this YouTube. You can speak anything about YouTube, your favorite YouTube channel, your favorite YouTubers, and what do you watch on YouTube? And how much time do you spend on YouTube? How long have you been using YouTube? So many more. Even you can introduce your YouTube channel if you have with the name. So Mithra Motin from Bangladesh is going to speak now. Okay, thank you so much, sir. So can you hear me properly, sir? <clears throat> okay. Yes. Uh, okay, hello, everyone. This is Mithila Motin. I'm from Bangladesh. So now I would like to say something about this uh, selected topics. It is uh, YouTube. So I am going to say something about these things. Actually, firstly, I can describe uh, with all of you uh, actual uh, what is the YouTube and uh, how it works and uh, what is the main purpose of uh, using. So actually, in my opinion, so YouTube is a free video uh, sharing and uh, social networking website as well as uh, apps uh, on the internet. And uh, the website uh, lets uh, people upload, to uh, view, and share videos. Uh, I think so. Uh, it, it too was uh, founded uh, uh, 14 February uh, 2005 by three uh, former members of uh, PayPal, Google, and uh, operated uh, YouTube also. And uh, nowadays, it carries uh, paid advertisement on the pages. And it is the second uh, uh, search, uh, search uh, uh, engine in the world behind uh, Google's because Google is the first place. And second one is the YouTube. Nowadays, it's very popular for searching uh, for information. And uh, when we are finding any kind of things, that time we can see several types of uh, videos uh, on uh, searching of searching this uh, you uh, uh, through this uh, youtube apps and uh, uh, such as uh, educational contents uh, animations uh, and uh, events also and it uh, encourages viewers to express their opinion of uh, videos they watch i think so uh, and uh, we can comment uh, on uh, uh, these videos like uh, when you just uh, uploaded any videos that time we can also comment by we need a, a account account to connect it and one video is we can see several type of times uh, that time it uh, called a views so in the last uh, i want to say uh, that uh, youtube is not only the kingdom of uh, digital entertainment but uh, it uh, can also be a great environment for learning and it is a e learning so that's it thank you sir well done sister you done very well well done matila well done thank well you done, sister. Well done, well done, sister. Well done. Everybody give a good clap. Everybody, please turn on your mic and say congratulations or well done. Now, let me call it down, Mr. Mr. Muhyiddin. That, let me talk to Abdi Ikhani. Hello. Can you please introduce yourself? Abdi Ikhani. Hello, Abdi Ghani. Are you here? 
Okay, no problem. So, Muhyiddin, you can start. Okay, thank you, sir, for giving me chance. Uh, my name is Mahyudin. I'm from Indonesia. Uh, today, uh, I want to speak about the YouTube. Uh, in my opinion, the consists so many information. Uh, such uh, big video so if we need to know about something about kind of, of topic etc uh, just we go to YouTube and uh, in my area in my country uh, I saw so many people uh, often their YouTube channel, YouTube channel. Uh, so if we have uh, about a specific part uh, of discipline, science discipline, uh, I think we can just uh, upload YouTube and uh, make our on YouTube, uh, so we can save our creation in YouTube. So uh, I think that's very useful for others people. Uh, actually, in YouTube, I'm uh, still not. Sorry, sir. Can you hear me, sir? Thank you. Thank you very much. Give a good clap for Muhyiddin for Thank stunning you, speech. Thank you, Muhyiddin. Everybody. So next, who is going to speak? Maria, are you here? Yes. Hello. Yes. Uh, you are talking about uh, advertisement. Our topic is uh, YouTube. You can talk anything about YouTube, the merits and demerits, and you can speak your experience of uh, using this application and you can talk about uh, great youtubers your influential youtubers and you can talk something more about it mm, yes uh, for example uh, uh, in my country uh, many people buy uh, they don't, they don't use internet to to buy something they they go shopping on the market um, and on the market on the store and, and they, they, they do many activities and in, in, in physical uh, person and don't lie they don't don't use uh, the internet. Uh, the internet we use only to investigate about uh, some topics and uh, about uh, our career or or something in in the pandemic we use in, in online uh, the class. All right. Unfortunately, your camera is, uh, you know, you are misplaced. Maybe your direction of the camera position is not good. So if possible, you keep your camera clearly in a good direction. Now let's move on to another person who is available for speaking about YouTube. You can talk well about well done, Maria YouTube. Sister. Well done. Well done. Well done, Maria. Well done. Thank you. Thank you so much. 
so Anna is here and Mary is here. Mary, hello. Can you hear me? Yes, I can. Okay. Can you please introduce yourself? Okay, I am Marie from the Caribbean, a small island called St. Lucia. I am an English teacher. I teach online. And um, yes, thank you. Okay. Uh, your country? St. Lucia. St. Lucia. Yes. Uh, you are the admin of the group? Yeah, that, I have been. Oh, you were talking to me on, on the group? You created a wonderful group? Um, I cannot recall that one. I'm sorry. Okay, okay. Anyway, are you from Iran? No, I'm not. Okay, I'm okay. a Salnushan. I'm a native English speaker. Uh, could I know your region? I, I'm asking your nationality, your Saint country. Lucian. Saint Lucia. Is it Saint... Latin America or South uh, or? We don't belong to a continent. It's a it's a Caribbean okay. island between the north and south of America. Okay, okay. So you yes. know the topic of the day we have chosen is uh, YouTube. So it's a wonderful topic. So you can talk something about YouTube uh, if you want, or we will move on to the next person. Do you want to talk to us about YouTube now? You know, you can talk experience of using YouTube. And if you have a YouTube channel, you can introduce and uh, you can introduce the great YouTubers that you follow. And what are the YouTube channels that you usually watch and you can introduce something and new things, new facts about YouTube, your experience of using many more. Okay, um, as an assistant teacher in my country, um, during the pandemic, I decided to teach English. And as a native English speaker, I was not sure exactly how to go around teaching English as a second language. So I had, I had to do my research on YouTube I watched a lot of different teachers, um, YouTubers, and um, I tried their approach. I tried their methods. Um, everybody seemed to have the same method. Um, I cannot remember their names because right now I'm done. I'm done searching. I have found my method. And there's this gentleman on YouTube. I cannot remember his name. Um, he's from India, and this is the one I really got a connection with, the way to teach English. I cannot remember. <laughs> Honestly, cannot remember his name. Mm -hmm. And um, yes, YouTube. Um, I have a group of friends. Um, we, we have Zoom meetings. They learn English as a second language. And we have meetings almost every day during the week where the the man, his name is Tony. He records every meeting that we have, every meeting where we talk in English all the time, play games in English, whatever it is, a conversation about a topic. Yes. Thank you. Thank you very much, Mary. And you please check your chat box. Thank you. Now I invite well done, Miss. Well done. well done. Well done, Mary. Everybody, okay. give a good clap. So, Mary, you please join here daily. We have uh, everyday meeting. There is no holiday for us. So um, we expect your, your presence here daily. Okay. So thank you once again to Mary. And now let me invite Anna from Indonesia. So uh, I'm our topic... sorry. I'm sorry I cannot type anything it's disabled you you can text to that uh, area if you text uh, it it will be receiving here no problem i'm not sure how uh it's not uh, you know the the chat box is not to chat everyone but it is a direct chat you can you can send the message here no problem <sighs> Anyway, if you if you don't mind, you can just check the the Zoom link once again 
and there is given our number for getting more clarification or joining our group, you can just send a single message to that number. The number is given in the Zoom link itself. So moving on to Anna. Hello, Anna, are you available here? Uh, sorry, sir, I think I cannot speak now because oh, my child is a little crowded. Oh, okay, okay, okay. After some time, I think you will be available. Okay. Um, I did see the message in the Zoom. Yes. Okay. Did you? Are find you asking the... me to? No, I'm yeah. still trying to figure it out. Okay. Anyway, if it is difficult for you, you just check the Zoom link. Where did you get the Zoom link? Um, in Lucero and Leaders Group in Facebook, oh, Messenger Group. Maybe, yeah. So you just go to the Zoom link. Um, I think on Facebook, the number is not given. So you better just text, uh, just replay here on the chat box, or I shall give the number here. No problem. Okay. I'll give the number. Please wait. So Anna, are you ready now? Anna, are you available? Anna, are you here? Uh, yes, I'm here. But sorry, sir, it is a very crowded from my child, from oh, my okay. side. Okay, okay, okay. I think it is better. So, I'm not... No problem. So, Mary, did you get? I have sent the the message. Did you get? Yes, thank Please you. Check. Okay. Thank you. Mm -hmm. So let's talk something out of the syllabus now. Okay. So let's talk to Mary because she is a native English speaker and an excellent English teacher. So let's learn and listen the musical rhythm, uh, rhythmical voice uh, from Mary. Hello, Mary. Uh, yes. Okay. So uh, can, can you please give us a detail about your country, your beautiful country? We don't know anything about your country. Um, it's an island in the Caribbean. Uh, we are located between North and South America, along the Caribbean Sea, thereabout. Um, it's a very small island, about... Um, 100,000 something people. Um, we, were, we were ruled by the English. Um, we had both the English and the French fighting for our country. And I think the British won. And um, um, we, we had our independence. Well, this month, we have an independence this month. Um, I'm not sure. 1979, um, we are governed by um, we have a governor general. Uh, we have a group of governments with a prime minister. Um, what else? Our culture, we do have a cultural language called French Creole. It's a little different from the French, really. Um, we also have a cultural um, event called um, Creole Day, where we prepare mostly everything that we grow on our land, nothing processed. We expose all of that to, especially tourists. We depend on tourism for an income. Um, um, I think we were, we were rated the first in honeymoon in the Caribbean. Um, the pandemic now, we're trying to live with it. Uh, what else are you asking yeah. about my country? I, I really appreciate you because you are speaking more and more so oh. it's really appreciatable so let me ask you some friendly questions uh, you know um uh, can you please talk something about teaching as far as i am i'm concerned teaching is my art and heart it's just like uh, my brand butter so even uh, it is flowing in my my blood so you know since um, my childhood i I had a mind to speak English and I had a, a tendency to, to learn English. So now still I'm learning and I'm developing my speaking skill and 
I'm following British English anyway, so I mm. like to pronounce words as per British English. But you know, many words that's strange for me. So still, I'm learning. So hopefully, waiting for your your assistance here. And Mary, let me ask you something about teaching. So, what do you think about teaching? Is teaching your art and heart? And how do you enjoy? Um, I always love to be around kids. So I do have a primary school next door to my house. And this is where I started doing assistant teaching. Um, they were like grade three students, but now it's grade two. And yes, this is where I pick up the habit of teaching really to kids. But I did get to teach adults as well. And it is much more easier to teach adults online than kids. Kids need more, more, much more attention in person and not online. So it's a challenge. I love to teach, yes. Um, it's a very, it's a big challenge, honestly, especially teaching kids because they need a lot of, they need a lot of um, things to be entertained by, not just teaching in a class and expect them to learn because you're just up here, you're teaching about um, animals, you have to make it fun. Even adults, they, they want the same. You cannot make a lesson boring to them. You have to be very fun with just about everybody. I have learned that, yes. So Thank it you very is, much. Yes. So Thank let you. me talk to Metila Martin. She's from Bangladesh. Let's talk something. Uh, Metila, uh, can you please share your COVID experience? Um, during this COVID lockdown, what have you done and uh, what were the new activities or how was the COVID situation in your family, in your house and in your city? Okay, actually, um, when the situation is uh, going to start, that time, most of the person face uh, like uh, diseases, uh, and also they just uh, locked in their house and they didn't do anything. They didn't go uh, anywhere. And uh, I'm also suffering that problem. And uh, all time, all time was staying in a home, you know, it's a very uh, boring thing because uh, we are, uh, uh, basically we are uh, habituated to going out and uh, do several things, but, uh, in that situation, when I was uh, staying in my house, that time I have uh, done many things. Because the uh, uh, most important thing is that I love to spend uh, uh, my valuable time with me. And uh, uh, that time I utilized my time to learn and uh, that's, uh, improve my skills, like uh, learning learning things in English because uh, uh, you, you just uh, already uh, marry sister here teaching things. So I love to uh, do uh, that things also. So that time I have learned uh, uh, some of methods uh, and uh, I have uh, also uh, started uh, to run uh, one of pages uh, and uh, keep practiced uh, uh, several type of things uh, so um, so that time i utilized my uh, mo most of the time i just uh, utilized it okay and uh, uh, another another thing is that uh, my uh, some of family member was suffering that uh, disease so it was a really horrible uh, thing for me because uh, I was really worried, uh, especially my little sister, because uh, she affected two times, two times uh, uh, COVID-19. So that's it. Thank you. All right, Mr. Albina, my question is to you. Uh, this is not a formal question, but informal questions. It's like a friendly chit chat. So Mr. Albina, let me ask you. Um, yes. You have uh, experience of attending several interviews. So can you please share your experience of attending any interview 
on any company or a school or any institution. Can you please share your experience in attending any interview in your life? Okay, of course, yeah. So, uh, well, when I attend uh, an interview, you know, I think that uh, the first thing you, 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 you need to know uh, what will you talk about? You must to 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 study a little a little more before the, the this attendance, you know. And um, you should be calm. You should talk clearly and not too fast, you know. But uh, with confidence, you know, because uh, uh, many times when you, when you are talking English, most People like me, of course. <laughs> like me, sometimes we we stay a little a little bit nervous. Uh, we stay uh, afraid to to commit some mistakes, and it's normal to commit mistakes. And uh, I think that when you are calm, when you know what to talk, when you know what to do, in in the uh, when you when you know when you are focused on what you want, it will be a, a good experience. Because um, when you are practicing English, when you are talking in English, because uh, in, in my case, I, I, my, my native language is Portuguese, and uh, I, I speak Spanish too, fluent, and uh, English. We are, we are just, we, we learn every single day in English, all right? Uh, sometimes we, 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 we stay a little bit scared, but um, the more we practice, and, and, and practice and practice talking with people, uh, chatting like this is a friendly chatting. Uh, I heard Miss, uh, Miss Metila about COVID-19, uh, Mary talking about the, the, uh, uh, her country. So when you, when you are doing this kind of job, it is increased and we, we feel more confident and more comfortable to talk with others. So that's it, that's my opinion. And, uh, Due to time limit, I'm moving on to the new members because here some new members joined here. Mr. Raizuddin. Hello, Mr. Raizuddin. Can you please introduce yourself? Because we have only five minutes, so please be faster. Mr. Raizuddin, please introduce yourself. My name is, my name is, hello, everyone. Yes. My name is Raizuddin. I am from Myanmar. Now I live in Bangladesh refugee camp. Okay, 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 okay. Very good. So, what do you do? Are you a student or an employer, employee, or Mr. Raisin? How old are you? Employer, student. Okay, okay, okay. Well done. So, I is this your first? Is this your fall? Very good. Is this your first experience? First session. Is this your first experience joining here? First class? Okay. okay, okay. Too fun. Are you available? Too fun? I think Maria is cooking now. So who are available? Anna? Too so, fun? Maria? Network problem. Network problem. No. <laughs> okay, okay. Maria, are you available? Yes. Okay. Are you good at cooking? Yes. Um, here in, in my country, it's in the morning. Um, we, I, in my case, I, I am cooking my breakfast uh, because I, I live with my siblings. Um, they are working. I stay alone at home. And um, uh, here is in my, uh, I, in this month, I stay at home in, in, Ma in March, uh, okay. I go to other city. Okay, so what's your favorite dish? Huh? What is your favorite dish, food item? Um, in my case, uh, my favorite food. 
Yeah. Uh, and my favorite food, uh, we we can learn, uh, uh, we can we can cook uh, vegetables and, and seafood because uh, I I live with my my siblings and they like to eat uh, vegetable. Thank you, thank you very much, Maria. Joining and next, let me talk to. Anna is not available, I think. So too fun, too fun, uh, too fun, uh, too fun. Are you available? No, Raizuddin. Raizuddin, what's your favorite sport item? Do you play football or cricket or badminton, tennis? Uh, my favorite uh, 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 food. Two pays, Maria. I'm, I'm asking to Raizuddin. Raizuddin, what's your favorite sport? Your favorite game? My favorite rice is a. Uh, uh, we 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 chicken. My favorite is uh, that. Where okay. are you from, Maria? Ah? Huh? Where are you from? I am from Peru. Okay, uh, so let me talk to Mr. Raizuddin. Raizuddin, can you please talk something about your favorite? Sport item. Why do you like and uh, some details? Uh, My favorite item: uh, meat and fish. Mm -hmm. What is that? Can you explain? You have uh, you have good listening capacity. That's why you are replying me appropriately. So you know what I asked eh? the question and the answer. There is no connection, I think. So no problem, Anna. Are you here? Long yes, time we are waiting you. So can you speak something about uh, uh, parenting? You are a parent. You are a mother. So. Can you speak something about parenting? Oh, my parent, I stay, I, I didn't stay, I don't stay with my parents. So I just stay with my you, parents. You are a parent, so what are the advice can you give to the other people who are looking after their kids? Uh, yes, actually, uh, to be a parent is sometimes not easy. For me, because uh, you know that uh, I have no maid to help me, so I have to do uh, 